What's up guys, it's Kyle here. Today we have the opportunity to be in Seattle, Washington in downtown Seattle in once again the Escala Residence Building. Today we're gonna to be touring unit 2405 here and here are the specs of the property. Two bedrooms, two bathrooms, 1,955 square feet of interior living space and check out that view. Now let's begin the tour. of the property. We're right now on the 24th floor. You guys can see the chandeliers up above. We're sharing this private vestibule, private elevator area with another resident here. This is the entrance to the hallway. Now check this out. We have incredible floor features right on here. Nice towel finishes. And then you guys have full wooden doors right on the entrance. Now let's go on into the building. Welcome on in. As you guys can see, these have a huge Full wooden door right here. Nice red wallpaper on the foyer area. As you can see, they have this area to store shoes and clothes and a nice little modern bench right here that contrasts super well with the mirrors, obviously, since they're the same color and also the red wallpaper. Now, I wanna mention here, hardwood floors throughout the whole property. You guys are gonna see different colors of this hardwood floor, but it is super unique. Love the chandeliers up here and love the entryway. Now, let's head on over here move back a little bit <clears throat> here check this out you guys have a nice little glass area little you know zen area right on here nice little plant you guys can actually store another bench right here or some collectibles now let's go on over here we're into the great room and the kitchen area we're going to start with the kitchen i love the stone finish huge island right here nice bar station chairs right on there dishwasher on this side smooth wood finishes on all of these appliances. This one is a more, you know, lighter wood color than obviously the other Escola residence that we saw, which was Gaggenau appliances. So this one is not Gaggenau appliances. You guys have still though, incredible appliances around here. You just have the star five range gas fire. So once again, we're gonna turn one of these bad boys on. Once again, it turns on and it turns on super fast. I actually love these, but obviously you guys know the Wolf gas fire stoves are always the best. Freezer and fridge area right on here. Nice stainless steel appliances. And then so we're gonna make our way now into the great room now. So <clears throat> here is the great room. Check this out. You guys have your nice little couch area. You guys have huge TV on here. And then over on here, hardwood floors with the neutral color as the background of this paint job. You just have two balconies actually, one on that side and one on this side. The funny thing about these balconies is that they are actually both connected to each bedroom. Now, nice piano set right here. We have the dining table right here. You guys can see it signifies that because of the chandelier and also super modern look. Now, let's go on into this balcony which is the primary bedroom balcony first and then we're gonna go on into that end of the balcony. We're just gonna tackle both these balconies real quick. So, this is a balcony that is facing west, and check that out. You guys have Seattle waterfront views right there. You guys can see one of the properties we toured on Rainier Square, that penthouse right there, all the way up there. Man, you guys get this whole glimpse of 4th Avenue going on all the way down there. Check that out. Incredible views. Now, let's go on back in. You guys have dining, outdoor dining area right on here for the summer time. Obviously it's springtime, so it's gonna get more sunny as we progress throughout. So on over here, we're gonna go on into the other balcony. And this one is more so um, for grilling um, and obviously a cookout. You guys can see this one's facing east, but you still have that glimpse of 4th Avenue right there. And it really reminds me of a New York City penthouse. This is incredible and you get it for only just under 2.4, 2.3 million dollars. So you guys have all this view for that price. And which is 
you know, amazing. So let's go on back in. Now what we're going to do now is we're going to tackle, we're going to go across the whole residence real quick and we're going to go tackle this little wine cellar area, laundry room area uh, over here. We forgot to mention it, but it's a very unique part. You just have a wet bar area right here to store your cups. I love the red countertops, really unique actually. You know, it's really a hit or miss. You know, a lot of people like this, a lot of people don't. As you guys can see, it seems like they love using red throughout the whole property, just like on here and also on the front. You guys are gonna see that more as we come on in here. Now, it's, you guys can see it's dark, but it turns right on. Once again, red countertops are here. You just have a wine cellar red. They have sparkling water to represent that, but man, you guys can store so many bottles of wine right here. And then, you guys are wondering, where's the laundry room? So, laundry room is right over here, washer dry area right on here. Nice red wallpaper once again. It reminds me of the Keating Hotel uh, in Kitchen Nightmares. If you guys don't know what that is, I might put a clip on here real quick. So now we're gonna go on into the non-primary bedroom, or I would say the second secondary bedroom. Each bedroom really has its own bathroom, but this one is detached, but it still serves the same purpose. Once again, you guys have a nest system right here for AC um, and heating. So, you know, the newest, nicest technology. I was in Arizona one time and they had that. Um, over on here, we're gonna go into the bathroom first. So, black countertops, signature at Escala, smooth wooden finishes, nice little countertop area, shower area, brown wallpaper on that end with bench seating right on there, nice little faucet. So, going on into now the bedroom. You guys can see where that balcony connects uh, with this bedroom. And then once again, you guys have this nice finished wallpaper on here. Really nice look, matches really nice with the night lamp. You guys can see they made this bed super well. I love the brown on all you know, of this area on the wallpaper. Now let's go on over here. Nice little walk-in closet here. You know, they have tons of racks here and then they have storage area on left and right. Now let's go on into the primary bedroom now. So as you guys can see, this one is a lot more open concept than a lot of the penthouses that we've seen before. It reminds me of a New York City penthouse, which is what I said. So this one is now the primary bedroom. Check this out, guys. So the primary bedroom here, a little dark, obviously, you know, there's no light in here, but, and it's getting dark. So you guys can see once you have Fourth Avenue from your bedroom, you guys can see incredible, incredible Rainier Square over there and Fourth Avenue once again. Now let's go on over here. Check this out. Double vanity right here, countertops and sinks. Super nice, his and her setup. You guys have a nice little storage area right on here. Um, right on over here, you guys have your walk-in closet, turns right on. Nice little marble countertop right here. And then over on here, you guys have the shower and tub. So the shower, super nice, marble finishes throughout. You know, the, the walls, it goes, stretches out through the tub as well. And over on here, check this out. Huge tub that soaks deep in and then you guys have marble all over. Well, thank you guys so much for watching this short episode of the Escala Residence. This is an incredible tour. Once again, this is listed at just under $2.3 million right now and has two bedrooms and two bathrooms and 1,955 square feet of interior living space. Now, check that out. If you guys want more videos just like this, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care.